NASA's Orion spacecraft has successfully completed its flight around the moon, getting as close as 130 kilometers above the lunar surface. The mission is a crucial first step in NASA's goal to establish a manned research base on the moon before the end of this decade. Ian June with the details. NASA's successful flight around the moon by the Artemis 1 spacecraft is the first part of the space agency's latest lunar exploration program. Orion completed its flight around the moon on Monday. This spacecraft had been cruising toward the moon since its November 16th launch and was not only unmanned, but also completed a crucial engine burn relatively close to the moon while out of communication with NASA. At the time of the burn, Orion was 370,000 miles from Earth, traveling at 8,083 kilometers per hour, some 530 kilometers above the moon. The spacecraft skimmed the lunar surface, coming as close as 130 kilometers away. The flyby burn began at 7.44 a.m. Eastern Time, but from Orion's location on the far side of the moon, radio signals from Earth were unable to reach it, and it wasn't until 7.59 a.m. that Orion reacquired its signal with NASA. Monday's successful burn sets in motion the next crucial step on November 25th when an engine firing will insert Orion into a distant retrograde orbit around the moon. Just yesterday, we entered the lunar sphere of influence at 2.09 p.m. Eastern Time. We'll remain in that sphere of influence, meaning uh, the moon has the greatest gravitational pull on Orion until we prepare for distant retrograde insertion. So we anticipate uh, to exit the gravitational sphere of influence of the moon on Thursday, November 24th. The spacecraft will remain on a stable orbit until December 1st, when another engine burn will launch the capsule back toward Earth. Orion is set to return home, landing in the Pacific Ocean off the coast of California on December 11th. Ian Din, Arirang News.